Hey everybody, welcome to My Usual Me, and welcome back to The Long Dark Interloper. It is the morning of day 294, I think. 294. Okay, guys, we are ready to rock and roll. It is still dark out, kind of. Yeah, it's just now getting light. I don't know if it's going to be blue skies or not. I think what we're going to do, I think we're going to go ahead and we're going to hang out for uh, about an hour. Let's go ahead and eat right quick. Let me get filled up on wolf steak, and then we're going after that vet, vet bear. We're going to go after the bear. I'm going to cook him up in his own in his own uh, cave, and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to see if we can't keep a campfire going for three days. Don't think this counts as a campfire, okay? I think it's going to have to be outside, so I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to do that. Probably going to be in his cave, but it's going to take several days for that um, for that bear to respawn. Let's go ahead and get rid of what we don't need. So we don't have to drag around a whole bunch of stuff. I don't need that. We don't need this. Is that fresh? That's cured. All right. And let's see here. I don't need both emergency stems, so we'll drop one of those. I don't, oh, the arrowhead. An arrowhead can go in here. That way they're all together. And I don't think I have any other broken arrows. No, I don't. I have 16 arrows left. So 39% on my bow, guys. So we are we're running low on the bow durability. So, yeah, it's one of those things where we kind of have to kinda keep, keep our eye on it. Let me go ahead and put these. I'm gonna just going to poop these rocks out right here. I poop, poop. Drop them all. Poop. Okay. And then... What else do I not need? We'll keep the hacksaw on me. Actually, there's not a whole lot I don't want. I mean, I I can... We ditch this one... This one um, 100% torch, because I've got three of them now. Three of them? Really? I do have three of them. So good. All right. And then I'm going to drop all the rest of this meat, because I don't need it. I don't want to smell. I've got 16 cattails on me. That's a bunch. But we're going to keep those on us, just in case i got to eat. And then we'll just chill out for an hour. Past time for You know what? I don't know if I can sleep for an hour or not. I don't think I'm tired enough. No, I'm not. Okay, so we're just going to wait for an hour. Let the sun come up. That way I can see a little better. See how the weather's going to be. The weather seems kind of gnarly anyway. But I still think I want to go try to take that bear down. We Oh. Is it going to get bad? I think it might get bad. Hang on. I've been playing this game long enough that... Yep, yep, yep. All right, we're gonna we're gonna uh, sleep for an hour if I can. I want to stay as awake as I can be. I hate to waste the whole day this way, but whatever we gotta do, I guess. Still kind of whatever. Let's do. Let's wait for two hours. I've got enough. Okay, quiet it down. I've got enough food to last for a bit. How much water do I have left? 0.25. Let's grab one more bottle of water. That'll give me a half gallon of water. I, I, I want to go out when the wind isn't kicking so hard. If I start a fire, then I want it to be able to uh, not get blown out. So this bear, guys, I think this bear... Goes out of his cave when I get to a certain point on the map. Like when I when I render in his cave, he starts to walk out. I think, and then he follows the same path no matter what. So, I think he's um he's a pretty standard beast. I don't have to worry about him doing anything erratic. You know what I mean. So hopefully, I can take him out. We can chop him up. We can uh, build a fire in his cave, and then I can go ahead and just cook all the meat in the cave while we're uh, making this fire happen for three days straight. I don't know. I don't really have a whole lot of firewood, so I'm going to have to be gathering those entire three days, and I'll be sleeping in the cave. But it takes like a week for anything to respawn, a week to two weeks. So I think the bear might take two weeks to respawn. I think a moose might take that long to respawn. Especially after a certain time, or a certain amount of time in the game. It takes longer for the animals to respawn. I really shouldn't be here where there's just like a hillock right there. Or something can just wander over the edge. 
and go, hi, how you doing? I'm a wolf. Can I have you for lunch? Yeah, that bear should be right here. Yep, there he is. Just came out of his cave. All right, so I want to... I can't climb up that log there. Where can I meet him? Let's go over here. Let's go around this way. See if maybe I can meet him on better terms somewhere else. Because he's going to get mad at me when I shoot him. Like, wouldn't you get mad if you, I shot you with an arrow? I wouldn't do that, though, because I'm a nice guy. But if you came at me, charging at me, you know, trying to kill me, then I'm, you know, I mean, it might be different. The cold is making my head feel thick. The cold is making my head feel thick. Yeah, I don't hear any wolves. I'm trying to find a spot where I can take him on. If he comes this way. If he turns, it might be a problem. So gotta watch out for wolves too. What's this? Hang on. I'm gonna get this because we can. We need. We have arrowheads now, so we're gonna get that. Cool. Now I can. Now I've got three arrow. Three possible arrows later on. Uh. Oh wait, this might work. You're a wolf. Oh, you took down a bit the deer? Dude, there's a wolf right there. Took down that deer. Two wolves. Shoot. He's down. I don't know about this one. Oh yeah, baby, we got two wolves in a row. And two deer as well. Look at all this meat. Look at all this wonderful meat that I'm not going to eat because I want to do. I want to finish my. Um, oh man, I want to finish my my thing. We have two wolves and two deer sitting right here. They're all fresh. Oh my god, <laughs> eighteen pounds of meat. Eleven pounds of meat. Sixteen pounds of meat. Twelve pounds of meat. Oh my gosh, and the bear. Shut the front door. This is probably the biggest harvest, meat-wise, that I've ever seen besides a moose. Where'd that bear go? There he is. All right, so what I think I might do... I, mean, I think we might start a fire over here. And warm up while we're waiting on this bear. Let's go ahead and... I'm going to start a fire right here. Uh, I hope the wind doesn't do something nasty. Uh, all right, we'll do the, we'll do the fire striker. 100% chance. I don't know how much firewood I've got, but I need to warm up while we're waiting on this bear. Come on, come on. And, oh, I have 22 sticks? Oh, yeah, I should be able to. Three hours, 38 minutes. Come on, warm up. Warm up, warm up, warm up, warm up, warm up, warm up. Yeah, cool. Can, am I going to be warm enough here? God dang it. I did it right in the middle of the two. All right, that's fine. Uh, go ahead and try to chill for an hour. There we go. Things are getting warmer. He didn't move hardly at all in that hour. Look at that. He's right on the other side of that tree. I'm going to stand right here, and we're going to chill for another hour. He moved a little bit. He moved a little bit, but he really didn't move that much. Oh, there he goes. Zoom. <laughs> I'm not going to bother with those animals. I'm going to try to get up on top of this log, and we're going to try to take this guy out. Do it. I need water, though. Can I do this? I can do this. Okay, so let me get some water in me. It looks like he doesn't really know what he wants to do here. I hit him. He bled, I think, unless that arrow just flat out didn't hit him. No, he ran away. I got him. I got him, and he ran the way I want him to run, too. Is he bleeding? Totally bleeding. That's not an arrow. That's a stick. 
All right, we're going to head back, and I'm going to, I guess I'll carve off a piece of meat and have a steak while I'm waiting for him to do his thing. He might come back here. I don't know. Just gather up a whole bunch of sticks. Look at this. It's almost picture perfect. Two wolves and two deer. Just, it's just amazing. Let's go. I'm going to take, I'll do that. Uh, eight, we'll do 10, uh, six, we'll do six minutes. All right, cool. Go ahead and slap that on the grill. 42 minutes. Do I have 42 minutes left? I got two hours left. Nice. Do that again. I mean, I'm gonna I, I'm gonna get full, and then we'll spend three days with a camp with a campfire. If I can get the firewood, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get the firewood. Is that okay? No. All right. I'm just waiting on him to like do his thing. Twenty eight. Unless the wind kicks up, I can fast forward this. Yeah, we'll do that. Grab that. Nine minutes. Grab that. We're gonna eat these guys. Thousand calories each, man. Good stuff. Good stuff. Ooh, and I have 769 left. I'm going to just drop that right next to that campfire. You know what I could do? It's not that cold. You know, you know we'll wait. I was going to say I could strip this the meat out of these. But we're not going to. I know it's a lot of waste, but those animals are coming back, y'all. I gotta go find him. I don't know that he's down yet, but... You gotta be close, right? Let's hit the... Let's hit the high road. We're probably gonna have to wait until... Until it gets warm and clear. I don't see him. We will be able to find him though. Because of the ravens or the crows. But I just don't know where he's at. Come on kids. What if he went back in his cave to lay down? That would be amazing if he went back in his cave to just like lay down and die. I don't think he did though. I think we're gonna go ahead and head back to the uh, to the camp. I've got a. Come on, let me up, dude. Let me up, dude. Okay, this will work. I don't want to run into him along the way. He's got to be around here somewhere. Wait. I just want to hear crows. Like, you'll hear crows, even though even if they're not flying, you'll hear them where there's a body. He's going to go down. He has to, right? So I'm going to head back. We're going to get warmed up. I'm going to chill out. Hopefully this snow won't last for very long. Oh, it's almost dark. We may have to wait till the morning. Yeah, we're going to have to wait till morning. What a bummer. I got him, though. I know I got him. a big area for him to be running in though so i don't know where he might be 
All right, let's go ahead and put that away. I don't need that. Kind of a shame to be only cooking two steaks off of 20 sticks, you know what I mean? But it's fine. It's fine. I'm truly not worried about the my end game at all. All right. Okay. That was so weird that we had two wolves drop two deer all at the same time. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and we're going to wait because I'm, I'm not very tired right now. So we're going to pass two hours and see what happens. All right. It's still snowing, isn't it? It is. It's snowing and it's dark. And All right, I'm going to just, uh, just munch in a little bit of wolf meat here. Get full up and let's get some water and then we'll just chill. We'll just go to bed. We'll just go to bed. That's fine. We did a good job today. I'm pretty proud of us. I'm super proud of us. Uh, nine hours. I won't be able to sleep that long, but it's fine. Yeah, I'm super proud of us. We did a good job. Unless it's one of those you go out of his range and, and he heals, like, and th th that, that bug. I don't know. Uh, some people have complained that that bug is a thing. Where if you, if you leave the area, the animal will forget that it was shot. And when you'll meet it again and you'll be... Wait, is it full moon or something? It's awfully bright in here. Must be full moon. Yeah, you'll, I mean, it, some people said that you, that happens. You'll, you know, you'll come back and that, that and the animal's like, well, I, you didn't shoot me. You didn't shoot me. Cheater, cheater animals. Uh, can you sleep for one more hour? No, but we can wait for an hour. All right, it's a bright and shiny day. I think we should grab, grab some more sticks, probably, huh? Probably, just in case. Where is our friend? Oh, I hear crows. That's a good sign. Where are they? Did he die like right next to my house? Oh no, they're going the. They're okay. They're flying, which tells me this is going to be a nice day, guys. It's going to be cold in the morning, like it always is, but. Looks like it's gonna be clear today. Super good day. Good day to go out and harvest and meat. Ah, it's a beautiful morning. Yeah. <laughs> and I mean, I've I cleared these wolves, and I think I've cleared those wolves. So this whole strip here might should be wolf free. Or almost wolf free. I don't know. We'll see. Timberwolf Mountain, the most difficult place in all the maps and the most difficult, arguably, version of the game. Soccer might be as difficult, if not more, because you got animals after you all the time. But you have more gear in Stalker than you do here. By and you have firearms in Stalker too. So not that I'd be any better of a shot with a with a rifle or a pistol. <laughs> Than I was, than I went and with a bow, but you know, you, I mean, you know, I might be. I see some crows. Did he really die over at, at his cave? Did he really? Did he really go into his cave and die? Oh, how nice of him. That's so cool if that's the case. What? Shut up. Nuh uh. He did! He did pass away in his cave. Oh my gosh. Aw. Winnie the Pooh. Winnie the Pooh. I'm gonna freaking start a fire right here. Alright. Well, guess what we're gonna do, guys? 
This is awesome. We're going to go ahead. I'm going to drop all these. Damn. I'm freezing. Yeah, I know we're freezing. That's fine. I don't care. It doesn't matter. Um, we're going to go gather up a bunch of... Well, should I... I mean... Let, you know what? Let's start a fire. Let's start a fire out here. Is it bright enough for me to start a fire out here? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Nope, not yet. Not yet. But you know what we can do? We can go in the back here and relax and get warm and toasty while we're waiting. Yeah, dude. He actually went to his cave because it was what he knew. Aw. At least he at least he passed away at home with his family. I think it's his family right there. Y'all are crying. Don't cry. Don't cry. I don't want to hear you cry. How long is it going to take me to knock this out? One hour for five pieces? Do it. Do it. Yeah. Okay. So that's ten hours. Just pick them all up. We're going to use them all. So cold. Let's go ahead and let's do this. Put this fire right here. So I can go ahead and do my thing. Screw it, I'm just gonna use a match. I'm just gonna use a match. We'll alternate matches, fire striker, matches, fire striker. I know some people are like, you know, you could probably just go do that outside. I don't know if it's bright enough. I don't think it is. It's too late now. I don't care. That's a fuel. Boom, 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 boom. Seven hours and 28 minutes. We're gonna go ahead and just add all these sticks, except for two of them, just in case I run across a wolf. 10 hours. I'm going to cut you. I'm going to. We're going to chop you up. It's going to take two hours. But how long? Will, how much? How long will it take me to get the 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 meat off of him? Eighty-four pounds of meat. Oh yeah, it's way more than two hours. Look at that. Way more than two hours. No, 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 no. Just do this. Am I warm? Am I getting warm? Is are we protected from the wind? I hope so. All right. Taking a chance here, guys. Uh, 79. That's my best bet right there. Oh, yeah, we're good. We're so good. Bam! All right, I need to eat two cattails. Get myself out of the thing. And then... Go ahead and harvest it. I'm gonna go ahead and do. We're gonna do a we're gonna do a steak, and then I'm gonna eat a bear steak. Take an hour to do. It should be okay. I think. I think I have a pot on me too, don't I? Can I do? You're gonna do some water while we're while we're here. I don't have a pot on me. We have to go back to the cabin. I have 0.19 gallons of water. Yeah, we have to go back to the cabin, um, which is fine. Harvest. It's 23. Take me an hour to harvest that? Do it. Do it by hand. Do it by hand. We're going to need to eat soon. Yeah, I know. I've got a steak for you right here, buddy. There you go. Eat that steak. Eat that steak and go, don't complain. All right. And... Go ahead and cook this guy up. And this guy up. I'm gonna cook all the bear meat up. And that's what we're having for the next 25 days. And I'm gonna lose my bonus on purpose. But we're gonna have to we're gonna haul this meat back. And hopefully I've killed enough of the wolves in the area that I won't be hassled by the by the wildlife. That's my hope. So I could probably I, I probably could have Started multiple fires. I probably should have started multiple fires. I only have two left. We'll have to wait for this um, this weather to clear before I can go out and get any more firewood. I've got eight hours left on this fire, so we're good. Let's go ahead and uh, this food. harvest this. It's going to take me an hour. Yeah, I'm going to do an hour's worth at a time by hand because I'm not wasting my tools on this. Screw that. Grab you, grab you. 
And once again, there we go. It's going to take way longer than eight hours to cook all this meat up. But I'm okay with it. I don't care. It doesn't matter. Um, just go ahead and slap all this uncooked meat right here. Put all the cooked meat right here. 1,125 calories. Bear is so good once you can eat it. So good once you can eat it. I'm going to drink this too. I'm going to drink all that water. Super good stuff, man. All right, so those are going to cook. They've got 38 minutes left. Uh, do I have... Hang on. Twelve minutes for a small steak. Nice. And then this one's almost done. Twenty-two thirty-two. I'm not sure I can carry. Much I'm not sure I can carry much more. We're gonna harvest, harvest uh, thirty-two minutes worth. Thirty-eight minutes worth. That first steak won't burn by then. There we go. And then we're going to go ahead and grab you and grab you and slap you on. I'm so excited. It's so good. It was a good day, man. It's a really good day in Interloper. I mean, I could literally go over and get the wolves and the and the deer and, and grab that meat for later. Am I going to? I don't know. I'm getting tired. I'm going to have to go to bed, but I need water. And I and my I'm gonna go back over to get my to my cabin to grab what I need. How much more time do I have on this? Seven hours and five minutes, forty minutes, fifty-two minutes. You know what I might do? After this, no, you know. Mm, okay, we're gonna drop this. I'm gonna go. We're gonna go. I'm just gonna run real quick. I know where. I know which way to go. I should probably just grab the meat and take it with me. The meat that I'm not gonna cook up right now. All right, I'll we'll grab all this meat right quick and just carry it with me. All right, because I want there are no timber wolves here, so there's no wolves in this weather. So we're just going to do this. If I remember which way to get home, I should. I mean, it should be. It should be fairly easy. Then went up on top of this rock, right? When I was looking for the wolf, I mean for the bear. And you didn't say you didn't say I had like seven hours left on that on that campfire. I've got a ton of time on that campfire. Can't feel my feet. But I'm gonna I'm gonna grab all the firewood I've got at the house too. And then we're gonna bring it back. Along with the pot. And we're gonna sleep the night in the cave. And all that good stuff. Like, I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way, maybe. As I hit the pond, I'll know. All right, old man's beard to my right. Yeah, the pond's to my left. We're good. We're good. There it is. Cattail. Where I killed the deer. Fishing Shack's dead ahead of me. I didn't know there were two cattails there, though. Oh, that's because it goes around that way. I see. Cabin's right there. It'll just take me a second to get to it. We just run the edge of the lake.
super good stuff, man. It's a wonderful day. This blizzard's freaking amazing, too. To drop some gear. We're not going to drop anything. We're going to head straight back to the cabin, buddy. All right. So let me go ahead and I'm going to drop all this meat off. We're going to warm up so I don't like I, I don't lose so much condition. Whoa, wrong way. I missed it. All right. You know, I, I keep trying to go up between those rocks and it won't let me. You think I'd know by now? All right. There we go. Let me go ahead and just uh, open this up. But I'm going to drop this cooked meat right here. But you will let me. All the raw meat right here. We're going to have piles and piles of meat. All right. The whole goal is to keep that campfire running for three days straight. So we got this one, that one, this guy. All the sticks. I'm just going to grab them all. Do I have any more firewood in here? Thought I did, but I don't. Okay. And then grab that cooking pot and this cooking pot. We're going to take them both. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to chill out here for an hour. I'm going to sleep for an hour. And we're going to go ahead and get warmed up. And then that's going to be the end of the episode, guys. Because I, I, it's a lot. Of, it's going to be a lot more work for me to harvest that, that, that bear. And I don't know how much longer it's going to be. So... I'm going to go ahead and leave it there. I hope you all enjoyed that video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please do that right now. As I always say, I am my usual me. You be your usual you. And then the next video, we're going to go maybe finish one of these challenges. Maybe two of them. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.